What I can say is that uh, there are so many people here in Africa. They are in darkness. Their children cannot read. Their children cannot even go outside at night because 60% of Africans, they don't have lights. Before, this place was always dark, you know, uh, blackouts because of the generators that were dysfunctional. I mean, uh, there was no security light uh, in the compound with the children, the threat of snakes. Before, we were living in total darkness. It was hard for us to implement our work, especially at night, helping children to do their homework, helping them to read. It was really hard for us because there was no light. When we came across this campus, we realized that their main challenge was access to power, or access to electricity, and therefore, Wildlife Africa designed a 20-feet container with 60 panels on top and a lot of gadgets inside there that will solve the power issue here. And as I talk now, last year we commissioned a project here that uh, took care of the power. And right now as I talk, most of the activities are running well. They have the children's home fully taken care of with the, all the electrical needs and power related needs. And we also have the guest house, we have the school department, we have the admin block, and the whole compound has been lit up by this system. Before this power system, here was greatly dark, but now there is light over the night. And we used to have kids who always come at night, but they are unable to come when there is light. For me, I can say for Africa, there is a great need for energy. Through solar energy, we are able to not only just provide energy for people, but also enable them to um, lift them from their poverty levels and give them, empower them to come out of poverty. So I'm very happy as you see me. I have my chickens here. During the night, they are the same like the daytime because the light is full swings, very perfect, lovely. I'm doing very well with this kind of business because light is still there. When the World Light Africa came to our country, especially in our community uh, of Children of the Nation campus, we got to enjoy a new computer library and uh, the campus was shining bright during the night and uh, the darkness came to pass. So that's what I enjoy most. Our children can also now access education that was done on TV unlike other children in the villages who were not able to, to, to access the education. We are grateful for what COTN has done for us. Thank you and thank you and thank you so much. Everything is moving very well. All the campus here is very nice. If you look at, at night, everything is very fine and good. My prayer is that Wildlife Africa it can expand so that it can meet the need of Africa. Indeed, just like our motto says, Wallet Africa is impactful, sustainable, and scalable. We see Wallet Africa being a great tool, a great vessel being used of the Lord to expand and uh, increase the territory of his kingdom here on earth. We are Wildlife Africa. Africa.